Um, do you think that your career uh, was deliberately de derailed? It's not a matter of thinking about it, you know. We all know that my career was deliberately derailed, you know. Even to this day, I suffer the same fate. 20 years later, almost, you know, and the fight and the same struggle still ensue because they want to apologize. And I said, no, 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 I apologize. Why you guys feel like say, we must have everyone going your way and who don't confirm they're automatically haters and enemies of your plan, you know what I mean? Yes. So, therefore, that's where we are. And I mean, my music is a music where that's why I'm glad that God had instilled something inside of me where it's not a one place it inside the eye. Great was an individual who brought it, you know. Your sight from Mount Zion itself. So them cannot take that away from me and I. And if the words, sometimes I'm so happy that I never explode, as you say it, yeah. on the international scene. Because when the man explodes, it's like them shrapnel out. And the remnants of that isn't, isn't even worthy to listen to. I want to stay as somewhere in the gutter. And it's a draw, and it's a trickle down, so. But still gathering a huge mass. Because up to this date, when my name is placed on the marquee, I haven't turned up and sing for a handful of people. That hasn't been in my, my history, and I give thanks. Yes. And I knock on great wood for that. One gets the feeling, Butch Banton, that there is this tremendous uh, Butch Banton fan base, albeit not, not necessarily loud and in mainstream media in, in, in the international marketplace. But but this way, this, I am a very popular underground artist. Yes, so, underground. Yeah. Popular. <laughs> Mm -hmm. uh, what's driving it? Why are they so on to you, 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 you suppose? I keep it real to the people, yeah? And when I go to sing, I really work for you, you know what I mean? Yeah, I work for your money. Thank you, but I work for it. Yes. You know what I mean? What about the message? <laughs> the, is, the message the, the is message, always present. The message comes in the part of the work also, you know? Yes. Because, listen, it's only a man who feels still consistent with the message. That him start out with. Remember, no, I never seen no one with a tall locks and say, I, I have got dread. I tell him all the time, so I could at least touch the moon with my hand. And I say, No, it's the last say I. Be a greater man who could have speak greater things to your people and uplift greater ideals from the younger ones. You know what I mean? You, 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 don't, have, you don't have to be nobody like who them write down there in a great book or anything like that. But just do you. Yes. And let time and the passage of time reveal you and who you is and where you stand for to the world and people are bec becoming and slowly understanding who I am and my music and my purpose through the music. Yes. Let me say, excuse me, we work hard for them. Uh. How would you classify yourself right now, Bojo? Because some people are saying, mm -hmm. King of the Vini, for example, says he's the King of Dancehall. Mm -hmm. Is Dancehall an important title for you, King of Dancehall? Or, or, or are you broader, bigger than that? Because, uh, yeah. How, What's important to you in terms I am of classification? Not brother, and I'm not bigger. Mm. I'm no man. I do not see myself as a king. Mm. I more see myself as a son, as a peasant, as I rightfully am. I'm a son of a black man. And I interact with people of my nature and of my culture and great other cultures and great other ethnicity all across the globe. I do not put myself on a pedestal because I'm a man who is prone to make mistakes just like any other man. You understand? But the greatest thing I have in my, in my corner is the love I have for my God. And the greatest thing I think I have in my corner is the love where my fear I. Mm -hmm. So therefore, upon such a love, him put great songs upon my heart and place them upon my lip and give her the, the strength to sing them and the courage to deliver them, you know? Mm -hmm. If this is what set her apart from my counterparts, then a man, if you're going to know God. Yes. But me not see myself as no king. I mean, not see myself as no man, a big and broad and no man. No man, I depend on to know a guy. So the dancehall classification is sometimes uh, you're not uh, classified as, do, as a dancehall artist. That, is no that okay with you? Music because dancehall sometimes get monotonous to me and it's, a, it's one little circle. I'm talking about a limited amount of things. I'm you know, great metaphors being thrown at me. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm not, you know, like right now I can prove say, uh, Vice Cartel is a man. He stimulate me, 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 me heavens with the music. If only him could have realized where he map. Yes. And turn the spanner anti-clockwise <laughs> and then turn it in the right direction. So it's misdirected, you're saying at the same? I wouldn't say misdirected, you know. I would have said no seat yet. I'm okay. saying seat though, because we're gonna take a time, but let me tell you. What him say, come like remind me when we did young Elizabeth Shaba as my mentor, as the man of me say, everybody else, he didn't did bad. But he must say things which 
accelerated. Yes. That get the woman excited, like a poem which is recited. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's not an ordinary train of thought, yeah? Yes. So this guy was thinking. And I find the similarities in this young man also who do some little things and say some little things and teach him biology and teach him some little things in him, little way. Yes, certainly, but 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 he so, but him can still get some smooth down for getting the thing on a level where him can because if the music can't be on the radio, you, you, you're missing your whole pension scheme, you know. Yeah. And you're missing your initial revenue base, you know. Even though Jamaica don't adapt to that formality yet. You see it? So that talent, that brain needs to be yeah. helping to uplift. Yeah. And it can power. Do, of course become seen as one of the baddest young ones on order right now. What, what, what would be your um, biggest concern about the state of dance all at this time? There's so much concern about the state of dance all, you know. It's not progressing in a, in a great form, you know. The old guards they need to chill and make the young youth them do them thing and get more creative and offer offer advice more from a a standpoint that yeah, this is what is right or you know what I mean? Because you them need guidance and instead of trying to, to gather them up and trying to manipulate them. I don't know about the, how the unity set up, but I don't see any. Mm -hmm. I see more like groups and splinter groups. But they, them eat each other so much that them go them take steps to sh even try to kill each other. We don't think of we never ever thought of doing those things. When you come in a dance hall, as a little man, coming up in the industry. And them days you have Johnny P, Shaba, Admiral. It was a joy to see how them, them operate. When them come through all the dance gate, them walk and heal all them virgin and then them go all them corner. And when I become a bit popular with Stamina Daddy and poor man and all of us you see in the street, baby when God bless him soul. Enough away. We, we have the same principle. We never leave a virgin in the street, no matter how Chris we carries, you know, when I leave the dance. Where y'all go? Mm -hmm. You know? And these kind of unity like when I got when we were in a studio and sing by something for eating, and one man never sing by one party and cocoa bread and one sky juice or something like that. Hell no. You know? We have a certain amount of unity that if the promoter don't pay one man, everybody disgruntled. Yes. If the if the dog man come and him buy one dub from you and him, you know, we all into the thing where we set up a group of people which was so unified and I tried my very best to the them The moment when you unify on yourself. And all of us come together and make this business a greater business and a greater force to be reckoned with. Because let us get entrepreneurial, let us get more business wise. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Let us ease off of some of the garrison behavior and some of the things and we didn't know from who we really are and what music really is. Yes. Them run left fire win for them said the dread too serious. Mm. You saw it? So when you ask guy, what is it? That is wrong with the industry right now. Yes. Dance all vibe, dance all wise. I could have sit down and tell you all sorts of things. You see it? Because all oh, you want to sing to a nation of people and tell them to unify when you have none among yourselves. Or oh, you want to sing some song of love to the people when you have none among yourself. So you speak with fuck lips and fuck tongue. And only when you are an abomination to yourself, man. So, so do you, <laughs> what do you say to those who say that Dancehall is fueling some of the social problems that we are facing now in the nation, it's including crime. Right now, <laughs> dancehall and dancehall artists used to, if gun a fire, they weren't a part of the gunfire regime. Yet some of them would have sing some gun songs, which was a reflection of what they were seeing at the time. Now it has emerged and, and it has it has quantified in this time so much that the guys in real and truly want to live out this drama. Okay, so how you deal with that? So they're being pushed now. They're, they're taking so pushed. far. They're, they're not, not being pushed. pushed. It's them own initiative. A guy no one only sings him a bad man nowadays. No one, no one have the records. Say my bad man. People say, yeah, man, I'm bad for true. He become the so and so and come the so and so. Well, bad man can't in a music. See? If he's a rude boy or a different himself, and people know you're different, your rights. That different. But if you want to be a bad man, you go hurt people and instigate the death of people. Or you go sing on stage. You understand? If you're a man right now, who's the ism one going on the country? Anything that can go on some car and say, Bertrand. Bertrand. What would I do? Bertrand. Bertrand, what really I do? But how it all work? If half of the man my buy gun and put on the same car and them, how you go tell the man him say, Peace, when you do a major part of the war? The man them take the business and mash it up. They inherit a business that we work hard for. When I come in this business, you know, I used to walk from Chancellor to the east, you know, walk from east to up a crossroad, you know. Jump on all the bus and go on a one ounce of badness, sometimes a pound, just to get to Bellwood Road. Mm -hmm. You understand? And for go back home. 
And these guys come in every all this labor that we labor and all and all these things and you no know, having a studio is common place. Cause all these are like a computer where the Dell and Mac and them say I'm a producer and I'm a rhythm where I make nice and they're all over the place with no rudimental structure. And them say they are producers. Yes? And it it, it what it do it don't make nobody use them craft, it don't make nobody respect the art farm. It's just so easy to get into. But look, but look and listen, how long does music last? Not very long. <laughs> <laughs> but are they influencing youth, um, uh, uh, would you, to, to take up arms, to, to, to hurt people? Yeah, they are certainly not influencing them to take up a book. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you regret anything that you've done? Um, I will regret that I never start learning the piano. Earlier on, uh, when I used to walk up and down in a studio from my house, I was a little boy, I learned to find out all that something to read them black and white keys that really operate. Because if I had to learn the art of music, I learn to read a score. You know what I mean? Like I said, our music is feeling, you know. We never get not, not, not tutoring from nowhere, it's just feeling and the ears right. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And through the passage of time, we, we, we own our own band and then we, we were around the so much that we can, you know what I mean? Help ourselves, so to speak. But mm -hmm. in terms of singing and recording and dancing and skanking, yeah, I have a regret again. Mm -hmm. I wish I could do it all over again. <laughs> <laughs> but you're still very much on par. Yeah. You still have a lot of so time in the music. Where are you aiming though? Where are you going with this, would you? The sky is the limit, you know, because when I started out, they used to tell me, say, in the thing as, especially the dance hall DJ over the last two years or three years, if they're lucky. Well, I lose count of how long I've been around, you know. But, but I try to make the thing not only dance but as diverse. Yes. As, as possibly, you know, by touching on all genres of music that I can put my ears to, to see if, you know what I mean? So therefore, that will enhance your livelihood in terms of your longevity. So, we must see myself in right now, just making some more strong music, getting into something that a lot of people in Jamaica detest further and down in my life. But we are going out with good intentions for the wealth of my people. Eh? Yes. So, you know, we just go on to some work and lay a foundation and put up some of the things that I know I'm going to need to help myself in that time. With the world in this global downslide that is facing right now, and you see all kind of turmoil globally, we want to offer some strength to the massive through the power of reggae music, and, and that's what we aim to do. Do you make a, a distinction in terms of your who you present where, where? By that I mean, is there a time when you're the roots conscious Rasta art, Rasta man, would you? Mm. Depending on who is standing in front of you. And another time when you're just a dancehall DJ, from Jamaica, I was just reeling off some dancehall lyrics. I don't remember at no point in time when I was a latter. Mm -hmm. I was okay. always, a, 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 I see myself as an ambassador from a small island who do a lot of songs where I can make them move, you know. Mm -hmm. And um, I, I think I have a little bit of eloquence that can make one listen. Mm -hmm. So I don't really try to plunge myself solely in the dancehall at any time, at any point at all. Mm -hmm. uh, you know what I mean? I try to be as round as possible where the music is concerned. Because, okay. I mean, no one wants to stand up for an hour and a half, sometimes two are just doing this. You want to move your body, body, yeah? Hi, thanks for watching our video. Hope you have enjoyed it. Please subscribe to our channel by clicking right here and enjoy so much more where that came from. It was